Hey guys, my name is Freedom. Today I'm going to show you how to create the headshots gun bullet holes for any of your CC4 avatar, any of your character creator for 3D avatar. Now you can see this is the CC4 Camilla and on the forehead here there is a hole which penetrate the hole skull to behind and this is what we call the headshot bullet hole. Like if you are creating some 3D animations like the someone using the sniper to just shoot at here, then this is called headshots and the bullet is going to penetrate the skull and come out from behind. Then this in this tutorial I'm going to show you all the step by step to create a bullet holes on any of your 3D avatar in Character Creator 4 and let us Begin. If you not yet get the Character Creator 4 and iClones or any of the plugins, you can just go to freedom3d.net to get all the software, plugin and contents and we can start this tutorial now. First, we are going to start from Character Creator 4, CC4 and you have to export any of your 3D avatar in CC4 as FBX. Then, once you choose to export the the FBX, you have to choose the cloth character. <coughs> then, the target tool preset, choose Blender, and turn on the setting. We only want the mesh, and choose the install LOD. Just merge off the, the material. At the same time, merge the opacity to diffuse texture. This is very important. Then, click export, click OK, and as demo, I'm going to export it on my desktop. I will create a new folder, name this as Camilla. Then the file name, I will just put Camilla. Then I click save. Now, you have just wait for a while because now it is exporting. You have to wait until it is 100%. Right, now you can see the FBX is already exported. Now I'm going to open Blender. Next, I'm going to import the FBX into Blender. Good. First, click the empty area, press A, and press delete to delete everything. Then click File, Import FBX from my desktop, Camilla's folder. Just double click the Camilla. Now you can see Camilla is already imported into Blender. Just turn on the texture. Next, just have a click. And then we are going to adjust the material texture. Just have a click and click the material. Scroll down. The blend mode, change it to alpha hash. All right. Next, we are going to create a gun hole, a headshot gun hole at here. So first, what you need to do is just press A to select everything and press Control A to make sure all transform and click this skeleton and press delete to delete it. Later we are going to, to re reset the skeleton. So now you delete it first and then next. Next click the face and go to the shape key here. We are going to delete all of the shape keys. Click here, delete all shape keys. Now clear, done. Next, we can create the gun hole. To create the gun hole, just add a mesh at a at a cylinder. Then this cylinder just press S to just make it small. And and then we can just click the scale and just make it longer. Then Click here, rotate it to 90 degree, then move it up. All right. This is for the hole. Alright, as demo, I'm going to just delete this hair or I can just unseal it first. Alright. Now we are going to create the gun hole, the headshot gun hole then you may rotate it 
and you must make sure this mesh is penetrated into the head so let's say the gunshot direction is from here the bullet is going to penetrate through the skull and come out from here then you may just make it smaller at this moment just change it to local click change it to local wait then just make it longer again and move it so for this part we can just make it smaller all right let's say this is the, the gun hole the shot hole next click the mesh go to the modifier then search for boolean sorry not this click add a modifier search for boolean then choose difference the object choose this cylinder all right then next click and apply then you can you can just unseen this cylinder now you should be able to see a hole at here this hole is actually already penetrated to behind then next click and go to the edit mode and have a have a check click so that you can choose hold the control to make sure you select all and we are going to change the material right now you can see all already get selected we are going to change the material click the material just create a fresh new material to use the red color as the blood color assign now done all right now we back to the object mode you can see the gun hole is at here we penetrate from the front to behind all right done next we can recover the head recover the hair and you should be able to see this, this set here then the cylinder you can just delete it next we just export as fbx so i'm going to create a new folder name this as camilla with shot headshot hole right then we save this blend file first Control shift s to save it copy the destination locations and paste it here name this as camilla with headshot hole then click save and we may want to to just create some blood set here so in order to do that you may just click and go to the texture pane so here choose the diffuse you can paint it here all right so you may want to paint some red color here the radius you can decrease it right then now you can see actually already paint on the texture 
So for this, click the image, you have to save it. Then click file, external data have to automatic pack resources. Then back to the layout now. Then, next you can just save it. And export as FBX. The path mode you have to choose copy and highlight it. This is to make sure all of the material texture embedded inside the FBX. Click export. Now the FBX is already exported. For this case, I'm going to just delete the, the hairstyle. Then I click File, Export, FBX, again. Now, back to the CC4, just start a fresh new project, drag in the FBX as prop then don't break it now have a look first we adjust the material texture click here copy paste now you can see the hole is at here this is the head shop hole Alright, next click here and then we are going to choose the the 3D avatar and then go to the accurate. We are going to rig it, create guides. It is going to automatically create a guide for the new rigs. Then sim everything no problem. Just click generate skeleton. Then click bind. Then click bind sc bind skin. Right done. Once done already, just click the accurate again. And now, this is a complete 3D avatar in CC4. Click and I'm going to apply some animations, some motions. The human female to perform something. Just for example, change the pose. Now just have a look, you can see the gun hole, the headshot gun hole is, is at here. It is really easy to make it. Alright, that's all for today about my tutorials on how to create a headshot bullet hole on any of your CC4, CC4 avatars heads. Alright, that's all for today. Thank you for watching. If you love my videos, tutorials and sharings, if you feel all these tutorials and sharings are very helpful to your 3D modeling, 3D animations and 3D game developing, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel and also turn on the mini bell and select all so that when next time I publish a new videos, tutorials or sharings, you receive a notification immediately. See you in my next video. Enjoy! Happy 3D modeling, 3D animations and 3D game developing. See you!